the devil it matters Five figures after We still down to earth and climbing that same ladder Living our best lives Here that we travel Meanwhile built this building up from the gravel Kids going fast, baby still loves dad LJ in high school, not balling with class Sharing the woman of the house, that's all facts And I'm the alpha male, I oversee all that I hope you get the picture This without the filter It's authentic over here, everything official Treat the YouTube world like family members And they return the favor back by keeping it real That's that, so welcome to a real show Uncensored, the blood raw, wretched and cut though This history in the making, fantastic folk This shady family matters, not the winds lows, what? Miles, come use the bathroom. Yeah, because he ain't use it. He's tripping. It's cold out here. Good morning, you guys. It's cold as shit out here. You feel me? It's uh, 6.30 in the morning. Baby's getting ready for school. Miles trying to shit. Constipated like he been eating fucking cheese and bubble gum. And goddamn Gorilla Glue because he can't seem to get the shit out of his ass. Nigga looking back at his ass like, what the fuck going on? Miles, go use the bathroom. Miles, leave MJ alone. Go use the bathroom. Miles, go use the bathroom. Go use the bathroom. Okay, keep trying to jilt. I'm gonna trip your ass. Okay, let's go. Shit in my house, that's grounds to get your ass whooped. So that's what it is right now. Um, I have to go to the doctor at 7.30. I have to go to their doctor. So I had to go this morning to work and pick up the paperwork for a workman's comp and FMLA because I'm going to be out for a minute with my back. So that's what it is. They tried to try me like I told y'all, but it ain't happening. You feel me? Not on my clock, not on my watch, to be clear. You feel me? So um, that's what it is right now. I'm going to go to the doctor in like an hour. So I see y'all at that point, let y'all know what the lit read, what my conditions are, after I get evaluated and everything else. Meanwhile, back at the ranch. No, I was scratching like you got that shit. Moms, are you naked? So you guys, I just pulled up to this goddamn um, central care to go get evaluated. Oh my God. So I'm gonna see what the lit read in here, man. See what they're trying to um, do for me. And um, I'll let y'all know the outcome when I come out. All right, baby, I gotta go, love you. All right, love you too. That was Shan, by the know. way. Don't think that was another yeah. female, that was Shan. Shan, say your name, state yourself. Where it you is from? my name. What is it? It is Shannon Vibe. Oh, all right. <laughs> let me know what happened. All right, we will do. Info. Call Shan, ended. Shan just got the word. I had to make sure she say her own name so she won't be like, nah, that, that could have been any bitch. That could have been any Shannon, but she the only one with that unique voice. So she know her damn voice. She better know her voice. She know every fucking thing else. You feel me? Fucking Google Queen. She better Google her goddamn voice. You feel me? <laughs> For real. I got hey, I gotta get dog. No, listen, with Shan, bruh, I gotta have proof. You feel me? You are guilty into proven innocent, bro. I believe that firmly. Like, do shit on every level. You feel what I'm saying? So, I had to make her say her own fucking day. So, when she sees this motherfucking blog, she'll be like, oh, they ain't me. I ain't gonna talk like that. Okay, I make you say your motherfucking name behind that. You feel me? I should have made you say you got there on social, but, you know, scammers out there, so I can't let her say that, because motherfuckers watching probably got there and try to get her shit and, and, and run up a check. You feel me? But I got there applying for shit while I got there credit. I bet all her credit on her name. You feel me? So fuck that shit. But yeah, man, that's what it is. I'm about to go in here and see what the fuck going on. You feel me? Get this shit squared away from myself. So I'm going to handle that. And I'll be back with y'all afterwards. Okay, you guys. I just came out. They did x-rays on me. Everything is fine as far as a fracture or any hairline fractures. I'm good on that. It's just um, sore. 
and like uh, bruised, but it's good to go, you feel me? But I'm still gonna be out for um some days or weeks or so. I have a longer take to heal, and which you already know I use my hip, it's a part of my back when I'm lifting. So all that takes place during my job. So with that being said, um, I ain't gonna be out of work for a little minute. Um, but as long as I ain't break nothing or fracture nothing, I'm good. That was the most important part. So now I'm gonna take these papers back um, to my job, these workman's comp papers and deal with that BS, you feel me? Cause I already know they are gonna try to try some shit simply because I'm a good worker and they want me back on my feet. So they are gonna try to have me back before my time, but that's not gonna happen. You feel me? I'm gonna ride this out as long as possible that until I'm fully healed and 100%, you feel what I'm saying? I have to come back to the central care uh, Friday. So yeah, I gotta come back for a follow up. So you know what I mean? That being said, that's what it is. So I'm about to go ahead and take care of this and of that and everything else, you know? fucking drink on the fucking car <laughs> <laughs> oh shit I call that shit on Canon camera though it is actually a Canon camera bruh vlog was day five lit nigga the truck hot look at him he hot he hot bruh that nigga rough dog bruh I ain't never seen no shit happen like that bruh that couldn't happen to me dude B he would have had to see me bruh for real what Hey, that nigga threw his fucking backwash, bruh. Oh, on the bitch car. <laughs> bruh, he threw his last drink of backwash Sprite on the bitch car because they cut him off, dawg. That nigga was enraged, dawg. He was determined to get in front of them and cut them off, dawg. I think that's what he really wanted to do. But since they was going the opposite way of him, that nigga went over that way just to throw his shit on him before he turned off to his turn. Y'all saw that shit? Just to go where they was going, just to toss his shit on him and then turn his turn off. Bruh. <laughs> See this rage I chill off? Y'all wonder why I took my fire. You feel me? I took my pistol for shit like that, dawg. Cause bitches, dawg, bitches will sometimes pull out this fucking gun on your ass cause you cut their ass off. He just was angry because the person cut him off and beat him to the punch because the road had merged. Like people do dumb shit, bro, and wonder why I be motherfucking accidents like crazy. That's why in this area, Orlando, dog, insurance so fucking high for fucking reckless drivers, dog. That's why. Because there's so many fucking accidents in Orlando, bro, that they raise the fucking stakes when it comes to the goddamn insurance, bro. Nigga insurance about down there four, five hundred dollars because of they dumb ass for shit like that. You feel me? Road rage, bro. Dawg, we gotta use our old address in Cocoa Beach, bitch, just to have a low goddamn insurance goddamn payback. See? <laughs> because these motherfuckers crazy. See how the motherfuckers speeding up on me back there? Better stop that shit. I'm gonna do the same shit fool did. <laughs> hey. But yeah, dawg, that shit wild, bro. I caught that shit for y'all, man. See what I do for y'all? I go to distance, nigga. You feel me? I go to distance for y'all. You feel me? To catch shit, dawg. <laughs> But yeah, man, I took the paperwork back to these motherfuckers, dawg. This motherfucker looking at the paper sideways like it's gonna change some shit on the page. Like, like, like it's gonna say something different. Like, motherfucker, that shit gonna say the same shit it said when you hold that bitch vertical. Like, it ain't no words gonna scramble and change none of that bullshit. So, nigga, it says that I'm off, bro. I'm not allowed to work, bro. Like, what don't you understand? You can't read upside right. You gotta turn up it sideways to read it. So that bitch like, goddamn, you feel me? Up and like, bro, come on, bro. Like, bro, it's horizontal for you to read, bro. Why the fuck is you turning it fucking counterclockwise and goddamn at a 90 degree angle thinking the shit gonna say something different? Like the words gonna fucking fall off the paper or regroup or some shit to another fucking word that you would like for it to say. No, bro, I'm not working. It says he's not working. He's not allowed to do anything until further notice. 
You feel me? Like, what the fuck? That shit, because you know they got to pay your ass when you're home sitting on your ass. They don't like that shit. They don't want to have to pay you. You feel me? They don't want to have to um, let you use your FMLA, which they don't tell you about. You feel me? So all y'all jobs got FMLA and y'all get hurt, use that shit. Motherfuckers don't like to tell you you can use that shit to your advantage because they don't want to pay you when you're home sitting on your ass. They want you to be doing their fucking work. So they can pay you. They don't want to pay you for nothing. It's like they're giving you free money. They don't like that shit. So if any one of y'all got FMLA or if you don't know nothing about it, ask your job about it. They know. They probably try to tell you some bullshit like, oh, you got to have seniority or you got to be here a certain amount of years. No, nigga. You can have the FMLA for any fuck thing. So anytime I feel it's necessary to call a lot for my injury now, I can call out like them niggas do. Niggas say his finger hurting. He call out. You feel me? And he get paid for it. FMLA. You ain't got to use your time or nothing. You feel me? That's what they don't tell y'all. You ain't got to use your PTO time, your vacation, none of that shit. But they'll try to tell you, if you don't know about FMLA, they'll say, oh, well, do you have any time? Do you have any time remaining PTO? Sit time, because they're going to burn up all your shit. You feel me? Versus if you had FMLA, they won't do that. But um, I got some shit to handle real quick. I'm going to get back with y'all. Okay, you guys, I finally get the rest. Um, Now, before moms get home and we cook together tonight, I'm gonna give shout outs to our old comers and newcomers. Got a couple of late birthdays I'm giving out, but hell, you already know, better late than never. You feel me? So that's what we about to do right now. Okay, shout out to Zanaria Life. Shout out to It's a Snack One. Shout out to Shakidra Fulton. Happy belated 33rd birthday, which was on November 16th. Three days after LJ's birthday. Shout out to you and happy birthday. Um. Shout out to the Johnson's vlog. Congratulations on their new baby. Gotta graduate them on it again, you feel me? Cause that's just wonderful for y'all. Not for us, for y'all. We done. Y'all keep on having them for us so we ain't gotta have no one. But anyway, uh, shout out to Yvette George. Happy belated birthday. Shout out to Danae Hunt. Happy belated birthday, which was November 16th as well. Shout out to Kiki uh, Monet or Moni. One of them, you know who you are. Shout out to Megan Gathers. Happy belated 13th birthday. Her birthday was on Thanksgiving. Shout out to you, man. Shout out to Leah Ray. Shout out to Savage of Gaming. Shout out to Travis Leak. Shout out to Ashton Hilson. Shout out to Zahara. Shout out to Monica38. Shout out to Raven. I know I'ma fuck this up. Tucson. Yeah, I think that's what it is. Shout out to you. Shout out to Meet the Robinsons. Shout out to Danny Ellie. Shout out to Brenda Jordan. Shout out to Dre and happy belated birthday. Birthday was fucking March 26th. Happy belated, 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 belated birthday, baby. Shout out to you, man. Appreciate you for holding us down. Shout out to um, Denise Wells from North Carolina. Shout out to Yakita from Chicago. Shout out to Maya's Life. Shout out to Three Times Game. Shout out to Nakira Jackson. Happy belated birthday. I forgot when it was, but I know it's a belated one. <laughs> you feel me? Because I'm that late. But shout out to you, man. Shout out to Taylor from Michigan. Shout out to um, Randy from South Africa. Shout out to Nisha Vibes from Kansas. Shout out to Yolanda Deason. Shout out to Super Hustle TV. Shout out to the Freer family from the UK. Shout out to uh, Zayana. Hold on, hold on. Got a couple more people I want to shout out to. Um, shout out to Be Happy. You feel me? For always supporting us. Shout out to you. Shout out to um, Jacqueline Hughes. You feel me? Shout out to LaShonda Ross. Shout out to goddamn uh, Ronaldo Singleton. Shout out to Mariah Starr. Shout out to You Scared, you feel me? Shout out to Onisha Wilson. Shout out to ooh, Latoya Carton. Even though she's an old head, you feel me? She still stick around and hold us down. She show us love all the time. She is a true family member who fucks with you. Shout out to Megan Dean, definitely. She been with us, boy, for a long motherfucking time, bruh. Like, she an old, old head. You feel me? Like, grandma to this shit, you feel me? 
She's like great grub up, bro. She's been around, bro. That's how long she's been around. Shout out to you, man. That's all love, too. Don't think I'm dissing you or you feel me? Riding on you or roasting you. That's just some G shit. You've been around. We appreciate you for real, for real. Um, who else? We got a lot of them, though. You feel me? We got uh, Till, though. Shout out to Till H. Um, shout out to, uh, hold on now, hold on. Shout out to Kill. Gotta shout out to Kill, man. She always hold her down as well. Gotta shout her out. Even though she be trying me sometimes, you feel me? And I gotta let that shit roll off my back like water on a duck. I think. Yeah, if that makes sense to me. Whatever. You know what I mean? <laughs> shout out to the second mom, you feel me? Gotta shout my mom out, you feel me? Because the prayer warrior, she always come through. Miss Tamina, you know who you are. Shout out to you, man. You always bless us, and even though we go through a lot, and you always wanna kill me, you feel me? After you heal me, some crazy stuff, ain't it? Mama's dog, mama's crazy, bro. They'll take you out, like they tell you. I brought it in the ride, take you out. Like, damn, my so you did it. Like, well, you wanna take me out to regret it? <laughs> what kind of love is that? We love that. Anyway, shout out to, um, shout out to Wildin' with Marcus, bro. Shout out to him, bro. Cause he always stopped through, even though he can't stay long, he stopped through and say what's up. You feel me? He hold us down. So shout out to you, Marcus, bro. We appreciate you, bro. For real, for real. Let me see. I know I got a lot of people, you feel me? Now I'm shouting out random people, bro. And if I don't get to you, you still know you family, you feel me? So don't think anything less, you feel me? Shout out to Veronica C, you feel me? Now I'm going off the dome. Shout out to uh, Lanise Taylor, hold on. Shout out to her, that's off the dome, you feel me? Shout out to Jojo. Jojo, shout out to you, Jojo. You still around, you feel me? She's an old head as well. Shout out to Jojo, man. Um, Okay, this is a new person right here. Shout out to... Uh, I'ma fuck this up. I'ma I'm fuck this up. Shout out to uh, Brinka. Brinka, damn, you know who you are. Shout out to you, man. That's a new person. You feel me? That's a new head. So definitely shout out to you. Uh, welcome you to the family. We appreciate you. You feel me? Hope you stick around for the future. You feel me? Cause you know we got a lot going on. Our kids run up fast, and they gonna be. Entrepreneurs and everything else in life, so you might want to stick around while they little. So you feel me? So if, if they happen to be doing real estate or some shit, like baby, you feel me? She also built shit, so she could be an architect and build you a fucking house. So you might want to support my baby. LJ, he could probably get you and your family tickets to his NFL football game, you feel me? So stick around, for real. We got some real shit going on, you feel me? So stick around for that. So, like I said, appreciate you. Um, shout out to um, Person. Shout out to Person. I think that's a new head as well. Shout out to you, Cherish McLean. Um, shout out to uh, Family Love 101. I think that's a new person. I don't think I remember saying name. Y'all already know if I remember you, I remember you. But shout out to you. I'm just going random, man, shouting out people. Shout out to uh, K-Sprite, definitely an old head. Feel me? Shout out to um, Miss Bolson. Miss Bolson loving life. Shout out to you. Shout out to Dewana. Dewana came back around. I think she, had, she said she had some things going on. She had to get it together. Glad you're back on board with us. Shout out to you. You feel me? I'm, I'm going off the top until I find somebody, you feel me, that I ain't seen before. Um, I'm gonna fuck this up. I'm gonna fuck this up. Jessalyn. Jessalyn Jones. That's a new head. Shout out to you. Appreciate you for joining us, man. Hope you stick around long. Uh, this another new one. Shout out to C Triller TV. Shout out to you. Boy, I'm, boy, I'm gonna be going all fucking day with this shit, boy. I shouldn't have started this shit. I don't know why the fuck I, I don't know why. Shout out to one of a kind. Blessed and highly favored. Shout out to you. You feel me? Shout out to you. Shout out to our goddamn girl, Yolanda Spencer. Shout out to you, bro. We appreciate you. You already know you're an old head, nigga. You feel me? Shout out to you. I tell your husband, I say what to do. Shout out to him, too. You feel me? Shout out to y'all, man. Appreciate y'all for sticking around for a long motherfucking time. You feel me? Through the heartache, headache. You feel me? The ass whoopings. All that shit. Shout out to you, um, Yolanda. Shout out to Daphne. 45, definitely. She's an old head as well. She's been around for a little minute. You feel me? Yeah, shout out to you. You feel me? Shout out to fucking Renika, man. She from my hometown. Shout out to Renika and her husband, man. Renika Brown. You feel me? Shout out to her. And she definitely doing credit stuff right now. Getting people credit right. So if y'all need y'all credit right, holler at our family member, Renika Brown. She will hook you the fuck up if you want a 700 credit score. Make sure y'all holler at her. And don't, and I don't want to hear nobody say, oh, you ain't shot me out. Nah, 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 nah. I don't want to hear that. You feel me? Show love for one another for the people I did shout out. And I ain't try to miss you on purpose. You feel what I'm saying? But if I ain't shot you out, don't hate on the next person who got the shout out. Just congratulate them or just be a family member and goddamn care about the people who actually 
got the love shown to him. Don't go to hating on him. You feel what I'm saying? Or saying I've been here, la da da da. You feel me? Uh, shout out to Naya, Naya Durant. Shout out to you, she an old head as well. Shout out to Rachel Clark. You feel me? I think she's been around for a minute, Rachel Clark. Hey. I'm about to end this shit, y'all, cause I'm, I'm running out of people. I'm running out of, you feel me, breath and everything else and this shit going too long. So I'm gonna give a couple more shots. I'm gonna give five more, you feel me, whoever come up. Shout out to Glenda Austin. Shout out to Wonderful, Full, shout out to Wonderful Foster. I always get tongue twisted trying to say your shit, man. Change your motherfucking profile name to a simple name, bruh. Wonderful, fa <laughs> Wonderful Foster. God damn, you see what it do to me? No, you gotta be stuttering this shit, dog. Like for real. Shout out to you, man. Shout out to uh, um, Indy, Indy Channel. You feel me? I think you're a newcomer. Shout out to you from Alabama. You feel me? Shout out to, that's Yolanda again, yeah, can't say her no more. Oh, I done ranked out of people. You man, shout out to everybody, man. We appreciate y'all. Oh, I gotta shout out DC Relators. Shout out to you, cause she always, bro, for real, for real. She's an old head, she's been around for a minute. I think she sent us some socks too. So I definitely gotta thank her for that, you feel me? Cause we needed them socks that day. You feel me, LJ stealing socks and putting holes in them with his toes, you feel me? Creepy crawlers, he fucked us up, she looked out. So definitely shout out to DC Relators. And I'm not gonna look at my phone no more, cause then I'm gonna keep shouting motherfuckers out and this shit gonna be long as fuck, and we ain't trying to do that. So I'm gonna shout y'all out the next round. But shout out to everybody who I shouted out, Shout out to family members I didn't shout out. Shout out to the haters that always give us thumbs down. Shout out to y'all, y'all. For real, for real, bro. We appreciate everybody. This, the negative, the fucking positive. You feel me? The in-between. Shout out to all y'all, bro. For real. So, um, next time y'all see me, I'm going to be in the motherfucking kitchen with my old lady. Not by myself. Thank you. We'll see you then. I'm home. She mad at you. Why you mad at me? Because you didn't pick me up. I ain't supposed to. Yes, you are. Yes. Yeah. Is nah. That, where's that at home? And then why didn't he pick me up? I was supposed to. Yeah, you were. Mommy was supposed no, to. No, I drop her off, you pick her up. You know the rules. Stop trying to give me your job too. That's fine. We're no, a team. No, 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 no. I got daycare for you to relax and time to go get Is her. It, nah, nah, it's time to relax. No. Only. Daddy, no. let's go. Let's go to talk. Let's go to Burger King. Yes, Why? Why? So, so we gonna we cook. Can, I already so got the shit to cook. Let's go. What no, so we can celebrate. Who said I wanna cook? Ah! Oh, Why you ain't cook? I'm fucking ready to go. Daddy has a tail. <laughs> so you need to tell me. You I, I just took that out. Oven, I just took that out. But you couldn't put this in the oven like I, I want to do it together. This take 45 minutes to cook. I you want, couldn't put this in the oven? I want to do it together. I just took it out. Cornbread. Yeah, we need cornbread. No, and you know how to make the rice. Right. I just took it out. We're gonna do it together. You lie. Well, do shit. All you gotta do is put this on the cookie sheet. We're gonna do it, it together. No, this don't make sense. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna do it together. How dare you? We're not cooking. Let's go to Burger King. Are you serious? We could, we could just go right now and just get the keys, mommy. Get the keys and let's go. Where's LJ? I need to tell let's go. You crazy. She got in the car and said, we going, we're going to Taco Bell today, but that's on the KFC. It's not Taco Bell anymore. Right. Nah, we're going to cook. Or unless you just want me to cook. Nah, nah, nah. I don't want it. I don't want it. I don't Baby, want that's it. your I work, state. I work two jobs today. I'm tired. I know. Like, she never really asked for how to eat either, so she shocked me. So right. she got in the car. Oh, that's good. So I guess I'm going to cook today by myself. You feel me? All the hearty and shit I done went through. We got them doing the vlog and all this shit. And I got to cook too? I, I had two jobs right. too. I gotta, right. No, you've been off for three days. Nah, I, 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 uh, two days and a half. Three motherfucking days. Two I'm days tired. and a half. Daddy. So I'm going to cook, y'all. Let's do it. Let's